Hey, welcome to the breakout session on anxiety. Now, stress and anxiety, the wired portion of wired and tired is afflicting most people around the world and definitely in the United States. So if you're here because you struggle with stress and anxiety, I want you to know you are not alone and I've got you with this headband and helping you to train your brain at home. I firmly believe the entire world should have this headband as a resource for offsetting stress and anxiety. I use my headband daily. I'm not kidding you. If you look in my sessions, my session history is solid. Even on the days where I can't get a long session, I'll do a four minute reset like I shared the graph with you in, the, in a few lessons ago. So what you will see in the example of the anxiety brain pattern is that it's dominated by beta. Beta is the highest line. The bigger the gap in beta and the other lines, the more that it's dominating your brain pattern. Remember, beta is gassing. It's fast to extra fast speed. It means your brain is not turning off. It's stress activation. So brains weren't designed to stay in stress activation 24 seven around the clock. If your brain stays in stress activation with beta being high, it means you are not getting into the circadian rhythm of the biological clock that I shared with you in the very quick introductory lesson. I wanted to set that up so that you know your brain is supposed to be able to shift in and out of these speeds seamlessly so that around the clock you can feel calm, focused, you can sleep, and you can repeat. If your brain is stuck in beta, you cannot feel calm. And so many people go to external sources to put the fire out in their brain. The fire is all that hot, fast energy beta. So that's why people drink. They use marijuana. They use prescription medications. They use internet addictions. They use explicit matter because those things artificially shift you into neutral alpha. And what that does is Alpha goes up and above beta and might inch beta down a little, but for the time that you're consuming, you're putting out the fire of the excessive beta. This is what I want you to know. It doesn't decrease beta forever. What decreases beta forever is a healthy lifestyle where you don't have to go to an external source. You learn how to bring beta down and to keep it there forever. It's the spice of life, being able to be calm and focused and put that fire out in your brain once and for all. So if you're training and you're using your headband and you see that beta basically never comes down, and remember on the example I gave you, alpha should be above beta and beta, we actually want a lower gap where beta's down. Your brain should be able to get in the mind graph into the calm and stay in the calm. So another thing I want you to look for is, are you able to get into the calm section with no help from something external to your brain? Or at least unhealthy sources. Workouts are healthy sources. I'm gonna give you lots of healthy sources in this program. But are you able to get that beta down yourself without turning to an unhealthy habit? Does beta stay up? Is beta up there in the morning? Is beta up there in the afternoon? Is beta up there in the evening? What that would equate to in your mind and your body is difficulty sleeping or crashing, but waking up a couple hours later. When you crash and you wake up a couple hours later, that's a sign of adrenal fatigue from consistent stress activation. So we have to turn off that beta, adrenal fatigue goes away, and now it takes you 20 minutes to fall asleep but you catch the sleep cycle and you stay there. So for right now, in this anxiety, in this anxiety breakout session, I want you to keep track of your beta. I want you to attempt to get it down right now using the brain training headband. And as you stay in this program, using all the coaching strategies that we give you that will bring beta down and keep it down. But I want you to know if you struggle with anxiety, 
beta is what you're looking at most. Okay, I hope that helps you out for now. Stay with me because I'm going to teach you a ton more about that. I hope to see you every single month in this community because every month there's going to be a new lesson on how you can bring your beta down. All right, I'll see you there.